Hello, my new one family. Welcome back to the ministry. You all, this is such a blessing. Right now, where I'm, it's, it's completely raining and it's very um, in connection to the water that I'm about to release to you all. I pray you all can hear me. I cannot do anything about the, uh, the rain in the background. I'm going to try and speak up to be as loud as I can and get through this one very, very quickly. Amen. So, as you can see in the title, it says, Are you set? Seriously, are you set? Because yesterday, on the uh, 27th of August, the Lord gave me a word while I was just sitting down in bed, and all of a sudden, in my spirit, I just received this sense and notion of a harvest coming out of nowhere. I tell you all, the Lord was ministering to my spirit about the spiritual harvest, um, the spiritual blessings, and also physical, um, financial blessings that are coming upon us in this season in this hour as we're coming to the end of August and as we're going into September and listen what the Lord wants to do is not for us to boast about that oh we have so much money like it's really for us to receive these blessings and use it um, to bless other people use it for ourselves for what he's called us to do where he's telling us to go but also for us to be a blessing unto others as well so I'm gonna go ahead and read two scriptures um, I'm going to release the word that I received in my spirit first on the 27th of August. The rain is so heavy, you all. I don't know if you can hear this. Amen. Praise the Lord. <laughs> so, um, so I hear the Lord. I'm going to touch my spirit saying a great and bountiful harvest of financial blessings is coming. Amen. It's coming again. It came before. Okay. It rained before in this ministry. It rained in February. It rained in March. Okay. And that rain is coming again and i'm prophesying over you that as i receive this word in my spirit it's coming again for you in the name of jesus christ of nazareth and and what makes us so happy myself and my husband really is that um when the lord blesses us like he's giving us what we need to do what we, we um need to do but then we're also now in a position to be able to bless so many people like whenever god blesses us we always want to reach out to family to friends to you all and we've helped so many of you all recently and in times past as well and that's been such a great blessing for us and god is about to do something similar something mighty again amen for the lord so a great and bountiful um, harvest of financial blessing is coming again amen the lord said this is the hour of the outpouring i tell you all you need to prepare you need to be set if god has i'm giving you an assignment to go somewhere this is that time to put your things together. If you're waiting for, for um for the for the finances to move to do what he's calling you to do, now is that hour. You all need to put your things together because God is gonna come through, he's gonna bless you with the money you need, the finance you need. The Lord will never ever uh, call you to be his child and then you know send you somewhere and not provide for you. No, 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 no. He doesn't work like that. What he wants to do is to finally come. Um, to you know outpour the blessings upon you to help you to aid you to, to um, get to where he's calling you into or to do what he's calling you to do amen praise God so I'm just hearing in my spirit right now divine provision amen miraculous provisions are gonna be taking place right now in the name of Jesus Christ and if you've already seen my testimony of what I released I think a couple of weeks ago I released um, a testimony of how I was waiting upon the Lord to provide um, a financial blessing for something that we're supposed to be doing and um, I will give my testimony of how the Lord uh, blessed us miraculously amen so we are in that time again hallelujah praise the Lord so I heard in my spirit also I was standing by the window I heard in my spirit amen as it was raining and the rain was pouring yesterday it's been raining like every single day for the past three days or so where I am so I stood by the window and the rain was just pouring down and in my spirit I had seven Again, my camera cut off. Forgive me, you all. So I had seven days praise, seven days rain. Seven days praise, seven days rain. And it struck me instantly, you all. It struck me because it's been raining nonstop for the past couple of days. And I know it's going to continue raining. Now, what the Lord wants us to do in this time is to be in the spirit of praise. He wants us to keep on praising Him, to keep on worshiping Him. Like I've already said in, my, in, in our past few videos, God wants us to um, um, remain in the spirit of worship, remain in the spirit of praise, praising Him for what you're believing Him to do, praising Him for a breakthrough. He's coming through, He's coming through, He's coming through for you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. So be set and be ready in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. 
Hallelujah. So I'm going to read Ezekiel 24, uh, sorry, Ezekiel 34, 26. Amen. And that says, I will make them and the places round about my hill a blessing and I will cause the shower to come down in his season. There shall be showers of blessing. Hallelujah. This one is a direct confirmation as well. The showers of blessings are here. I remember when the Lord was uh, um, preparing me to move forward to cross over to being with my husband that he restored us the Lord ministered to me in my sleep literally he told me I heard a voice in my sleep that time um, I had showers of blessings and I tell you all literally it was less than three days after I heard that that voice said showers of blessings and the blessings came pouring in that we booked our ticket and we and we you know went off crossed over into the promised land okay the Lord is amazing the Lord is good amen Amos 9 13 to 15 we all know this Yes, it won't be long now. God's decree, things are going to happen so fast. Your head will swim. One thing fast on the heels of the other. You won't be able to keep up. Everything will be happening at once. Amen. And everywhere you look, blessings, blessings, like wine pouring off the mountains and hills. I'll make everything right again for my people. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Amen. So that is the word of the Lord for somebody today i pray for you in the mighty name of jesus christ and i pray for the body of christ also that we will receive um the uh the uh blessings that god has in store for us spiritual blessings physical blessings financial blessings amen our uh, blessings that come in form of a favor amen favor from man and of god supernatural favor is your portion in the name of jesus christ of nazareth so you all just be encouraged and be strengthened in the lord and continue to praise him even right now let's begin to praise the lord Father, we thank you for what you are about to do. We give you glory. We give you honor. We give you praise, Heavenly Father, because you are mighty. You are awesome. You are wonderful. You are marvelous. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for all you have done for me. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Hey, you are worthy, Lord. You are worthy, Lord. You are worthy, Lord. What is to be praised? You are what he loves. Jesus, you are what he loves. You are what he loves. What is to be praised? Angels are singing. You are what the alarm. Oh, Lord, you are what Angels are singing. You are what the alarm. Oh, Lord, you are what the alarm. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Father God, we thank you. We bless you. And I bless every single one of you. May God keep you and cover you in his blood. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, nothing will steal your blessing. Remain focused. Protect your blessing. Uh, be wise. Be responsible in managing your finances. And ask for grace from the Holy Spirit. Amen. To so manage your finances wisely. We love you all so much. If you're new, be a part of Neiman God Favorite Church. And we'll see you on the next one. Every link. For giving is in the bar below please understand the principles of giving as well okay there is seed time there's harvest time if you don't sow you will not receive okay i'm not saying because i want you to give to this ministry there are so many ways that you can give unto the lord you can give your time you can give money you can give resources amen hallelujah praise god just look around you who needs help in your family amongst your friend or in your church sow your time so money seeds, amen, and the Lord will bring in the harvest upon you. Don't sit in your home and uh, wait for the Lord to bless you when you haven't been sowing. If it's placed it on your heart to give, definitely give, okay? The Lord Christ, um, our Savior, said it's more blessed for you to give than to receive, amen? So, the, so um, the, the Lord bless you all, bless you all, bless you all, bless you all, and we'll see you all very soon. I'm so tired of you all, like this baby, Woo! I'm getting closer, but praise Jesus anyway. 